Good afternoon. Um, the cousin's playing so sweetly. And Teddy, of course, has an apple. The humidity and my hair. This is just, this is like my postpartum grow out. Such a look. Um, but we came to the Sikars today because we can do that now. And just come and hang out during the day. Um, so we had some pizza for lunch and Christina is gonna do an unboxing. Ooh, cute. Those are nice. I'm worried that because I have flat feet, I can hopefully yeah. hurt. Mm -hmm. You can just get inserts. Yeah. She hopped on the Hoka train. We're gonna see what they're all about. You're gonna run like the wind with those little wings on your back. Okay, from here down, you do look like our dad. <laughs> Just because you guys have nice calf muscles. Ooh. So he didn't take a nap today, so he fell asleep in the drive over. He did take a nap, but it was just 20 minutes oh. in the car. But we really wanted to see the pumpkins, because he loves pumpkins. Okay. How does he say it? Pumpkin. Pumpkin. <laughs> he'll wake up sometimes and go, Hi, pumpkin. Because he'll, he'll want duck and, the duck and goose episode of with pumpkins and Halloween. So we, we came to see pumpkins. He'll wake up eventually. We just like... We really had to wait till August 1st to see them instead of July 31st because they went up yesterday and we thought that was way too early. <laughs> August 1st. And what are we doing August 3rd? Decorating Thursday. So I don't think we explained this just yet, but with tomorrow being the transfer, which is incredibly awesome and another reason why we're here to soak up magical good juju, I'm actually done working for the week. So we planned a couple weeks ago to stay at uh, Bonnet Creek Resort, one of my company's uh, timeshare like resorts on Disney property right by Epcot. We're actually staying there Friday and Saturday night, so I had planned to take off Friday, and then last week we found out, hey, Embryo's Wednesday. So I was talking to Sarah, and then I was later talking to my team, and I was like, okay, so I'm taking off Wednesday, taking off Friday, why go back yeah, Thursday? So, I'm not, so we're gonna decorate for Halloween on Thursday. Well, for fall. We're for fall and a little bit of Halloween. Uh, oh, Teddy's Oh, Teddy's Yeah. So, I'm done working for the week. My short week is over. I don't go back to work till Monday. Uh -huh. Ooh, yeah. And there'll be a baby in my belly. <laughs> more than when we saw a line yesterday. Yeah. Was These was, I thought just the ones Remember we carved our pumpkins like that? Yeah. You know? And this bunting. Isn't it like a bunt cake? Yeah, that's what those like little bunt. half circle things are. Bunt. Bunting. Bunt. And the scarecrows. Wow, it's Halloween time. Bright, like neon y colors, so different. Peter's FaceTiming the air hearts. These ones are classic little candy corn. This little candy dish, I like it. Usually it's like a spooky face, but this is like a little sneaky with the wing. I love it. And these little guys light up. Do you remember? She just touched so much sweat on the back of my head. Do you remember, was it our 2016 And you moved trip? your hand, so like, I'm kind of offended. It was like a no, place... No! Oh. I wanted it to be on your shoulder. Remember? I think it was 2016, yeah. We like... We took like photos like this. Took photos like this. And we danced. We wished for babies. Oh, and it would, it would be quite some time before. I actually was like hopeful I was pregnant on that trip. 
I remember even telling Chelsea, being like, you never know. And now we have another embryo transfer tomorrow. <laughs> What'd you just say? Halloween is basically Christmas, so on every time. We just like the holiday time. Wow. 147 days. Um, Mickey, Minnie, Charlie Brown crossover? It is, you and me. We should be them for Halloween. Across the Mississippi, come on. We're crossing the Mississippi. Letting Teddy stroll. We've been very Tomorrowland, Fantasyland centric lately. So we're gonna spend some time in good old Frontierland. Foods coming soon. Ah! Yeah, they haven't seen. The water tower. Yeah, I think it looks great. I love her crown on it. I hope it lights up at night. Oh, he wants the boat. <laughs> the clutches of AC moves. Country, but and you could tell it's been a minute. We didn't know they took out the turnstiles. Yeah, weird. When was the last time we've been on this? This is like my college program smell. Because I work at Prairie Outpost, the speech shop, and the training pin shop, this like smells like college program. What's going on now? Let's get on to the show. The duckies over here. Duck, quack 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 quack. Our theme for Jamesy this week to like learn vocabulary is farm animals. And ducks, ducks are a part of it. Jamesy is now awake and himself. We're gonna go on people mover before I go on Space Mountain one last time. Big kids. Please supervise younger beings. Stay clear of the doors, which will open and close automatically. Enjoy your journey. Ready. Para su seguridad, permanezca y mantenga sus manos, brazos, pies y Are you ready, Jamesy? This is the TTA Blue Line. Non-stop service. <laughs> See you my stars is there ever lots to see from spacecraft to monster laughs there's really nothing like today in tomorrowland your express train <laughs> keeps on rolling through the future right by two of my favorite spots yeah, and dry white cycle run i love a good circuit and these are two of the best tracks of thousands for a bit of light speedy competition celestial symbol of interplanetary harmony and fellowship. Hop aboard and launch high above Tomorrowland for a spin amongst the planets. We got it done. It's 
Space Mountain is really the last thing I really wanted to get on um, before the transfer. Attention so, Space Mountain passengers. Here we are. That's really why we came here Space tonight. It's also my parents' anniversary, so we're hoping to find Pirates, which is their favorite. And just being here on their anniversary is nice, but really happy to get this checked off. Oh, I'm having regrets. Sarah almost bought Lightning Lane earlier for a nighttime time slot. Cause I think it's unreal. We haven't done it at night, but I can only imagine how unreal it is, but woo! Here he goes, just a running down the street, saying do I do it, do We have yet to get AC relief, and Sarah's going in Space Mountain. So we're gonna go hang out in the playground area of Dumbo. I can already feel it. Woo! That AC is real. Um. There's almost nobody in here, and we're hearing noises that I don't think we've ever heard before. The boys love this space. Wow. Get in your car, Teddy. James is cranking it. Fun fact, the play area closes at nine. So we were out in there for like 10 minutes getting some AC playing, and now we're all in Dumbo. How fun. Whoa. Once again, just absolutely gorgeous at night, especially this Tomorrowland sign that's newer with the construction. This worked out perfectly where I walked the boys over, hung out in the playground, went on Dumbo, had some snacks, got ourselves ready. Wow! And now Sarah's done. So we're gonna meet back up and I have a I have a proposition for the rest of the night that includes not watching the fireworks. But I wanna wanna put it past Sarah to see. I think she just got that shot on the camera. How'd you like Space Mountain? I have a proposition that includes not watching the fireworks. What? I have a proposition that includes not watching the fireworks. Well they gotta roll. Okay, we're switching up the order of our plan a little bit. We're gonna do Pooh Bear first, because it's here. Oh gosh, the gloomy place. Good job. <laughs> You're brave. Here we go! Time to go to the 100 acre wood! They love it. I don't think he's ever sat here before. His little ankles are crossed. Such a big kid now. The east wind traded places. If you ask me, he'll never reach that point. Watch out for epilogues and noodles. They're still honey. So we have 10 minutes to spare and we're gonna get me on one last ride, Big Thunder Mountain, and now strolling Frontierland like this. This is my college program. Like right at park close, things are starting to close up. I'm with Megan Petrus. 10 plus years ago, 
because that's how long, that's where me and Megan met. And now we're BFFs. Um, but yeah, this is so nostalgic and so special. I'm gonna get one last ride in before tomorrow. And like, oh, we'll throw that one I've been starting to like get butterflies and be like, it's sinking in that tomorrow is embryo transfer day. It's been a while, I feel like, since we closed down Magic Kingdom. We got some waters and a Sprite, and the boys got some stickers. Well, Mommy went to go go on Big Thunder Mountain, since she won't be able to go on roller coasters as of tomorrow. You want me to carry you? You tired? But look at this empty adventure land. Some beautiful music coming out of Tortuga Tavern. I'm gonna go back to the stroller and meet Mommy. Big Thunder and Space Mountain. Right, and like, we did a lot tonight. We did. <laughs> we really did. It was wonderful. We have not stopped sweating. No. It's so hot. There. We have a check back to the car over at TTC, and we are yeah. hoping James is pumped because he was asleep when we got in. Yeah. And we hope he's pumped for the pumpkins as we leave on Main Street. This is another college program view. Yeah. I would, this is like where we would leave the strollers. Like one of our jobs at the end of the night was to like pick up all the stray strollers and then we would bring them here. And then the stroller cast members would pick them up right here. Jamesy, look up there. What do you see? <laughs> what? He's realizing what pumpkin. You see more pumpkins? What is this? We Wait. decided from the wild. So I was deceived. There doesn't know I took a clip at Adventureland when it was like empty. Oh really? <laughs> Everybody in the entire park was not in Adventureland. In actuality, they were in the front of the park. Either taking the express monorail or the ferry. Yeah. So we did something a little wild. We're gonna walk to the park. And we're parked far in the back, but. But it's only been five minutes. Yeah. And we're already almost there. Mm -hmm. We're gonna pick up some milk from Teddy. I forgot how far back we were parked. Yeah, maybe um, change the kids into jams. Yeah. This is a good move. We're I, we're a little trying to convince ourselves, but also no, what, that. Yeah. Yeah. So the signage has been spunked up on this path. Last time it looked like summer camp. It did. And last time we also had a cross. <laughs> the street over there. So this is an upgrade. Yeah. Like a fairly equal time to be like it was it's not it's like a But not, we're like we're trekking it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but I think that's like that could be faster than taking the ferry with how the crowds were looking for the monorail. Mm -hmm. um, or it could be a little slow, but like I was telling Sarah, the kids are in good spirits with us moving, yeah. um, which is great. And we're in good spirits because like we're moving. Sarah and I often talk about like we'd rather be moving in traffic, driving somewhere, than in like stopping. Off. Right. It's late, but the boys are asleep and we're home. It was a good night. It was a good Tuesday. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>